Okay, what do you think of this, the Chevy Blazer? An American car, if ever there was one. Big, brash and American. We need to drive it. Jump in. Well, Jeremy, I think the third and final 4x4 that we're driving, the Chevy Blazer, is definitely a lot more comfortable and a lot more luxurious, it I would is. say. Stunningly so. It's like being in a, a more a market car. Yeah. You're just sitting here at the moment, apart from your driving position, you think you're driving a car. It's smooth, it's comfortable, it's refined. It's great. Yeah. <laughs> I'm surprised. A 4 litre V6 engine here. Yep. Producing bags of power, 200 brake horsepower or so. Makes so it very drivable. Silky smooth. I'm actually quite impressed with it. Yeah. It's nice to drive. It's We're going up this hill again. Up this big hill. It does it, doesn't it? No easily. problems. No problem at all. Whacking great engine. I mean, it's. <laughs> you you felt it. Use a gallon of fuel. fuel. Yeah, I dread to think where the, the trip meter <laughs> is. It. So I find out my last gallon. But you've got four-wheel drive again, obviously. Um, yeah. But what you can do with this is you can select it electronically. You can go along and have it working electronically. And if it detects any slippage, you know, if you're on an icy, snowy road, yep. it'll flick it over the four-wheel drive straight away. Could be useful in the winter around here. Absolutely. Let's find out more about the Chevy Blazer. Here's Chris. How can I describe the Chevrolet Blazer? Well, it's big. It's huge. It's gigantic. That's on the plus side. On the downside, it's too big. It's too brash and it's far too thirsty. Now, now, don't get me wrong, you get a lot of 4x4 for your money, and I've got to tell you, only the latest models are right-hand drive. It's big and cumbersome. It's not too sharp on corners, and if you were thinking of buying one of these to drive around town, then maybe you'd want to think again. But there is a big plus about the Chevy. It loves the great outdoors. It's got plenty of low-down, mid-range power, so if you get one of these, Please, please, take it mud plugging. You'll feel really safe in one of these. It meets all US stringent safety standards and more. And it feels big. The window controllers are big. The radio is big. And above you, you have all these other compartments just to store bits and pieces. I do have to tell you though, the only bit of security you get on one of these is an alarm. So I would advise that you get in contact with Thatchums and get your immobiliser and for extra peace of mind, maybe have a tracker fitted. The engine is a 4.3 V6. It'll average 19 miles to the gallon. This is a V registration. It's got 28,000 miles on the clock and it'll cost you 10 grand. The Chevy Blazer is pure American beef. It's a muscle car with a cracking V6 petrol engine, which unfortunately is very thirsty. Insurance on the Blazer is Group 15. Now, there are very few around on the market, so if you want one, you'll certainly have to search hard to find the right one. They were introduced in 1998 in right-hand drive in the UK, but you'll find earlier left-hand drive examples available. 